Let us look at this critical path problem. This is a very practical problem faced by project managers every single day. First of all, we are given with this network diagram with a bunch of activities on it, right? Activities are R, S, T, U, V, and W. And below in this table, we are given duration for each activity. First question is, what is the critical path of the project? Second question is, how many days are needed for the project? To solve this, we know by definition, critical path is the longest path through the network. Again, critical path is the longest path through the network. Let's write it down. R is, R is 5, S is 4, T is 7, U is 9, V is 6, W is 6. So my question is, how many paths this network has? Well, there are three paths. First one is start. R, S, T, and finish. And what's the second path? It start, U, T, and finish. And the third path is start, U, V, W, and finish. Let's write it down. So the first path is start RST finish. Second path is start UT and finish. Third path is start UVW and finish. Let's add uh, RST first. So RST is 16. So it's the sum of R plus s plus t ut is also 16 it's u plus t and path u v w is 21 it's u plus v plus w so it's 21 so which is the longest path in the network longest path is start u v w and finish so that's our answer to the first question. Answer to the second question is, what's the answer? How many days are needed for the project? The answer is 21 days, 21. I hope this video was helpful in your understanding of how to find and calculate critical path of a project.